Stockton police are investigating a shooting that left a 17 year old boy dead. That shooting happened at West Oak Street just before 7 30 last night. Now, this is Stockton's 47th homicide of the year. CBS 13's Elisa Becerra joins us now in Stockton with more on the investigation. Elisa? That's right. As you said, this marks 47 for the city of Stockton. Last year, they ended with 49, and each one of those numbers represents a person. Last night's person was a teenager. Uh I can't believe it. A man identifying himself as the godfather of a 17 year old man who was shot to death in the Stockton parking lot points to a bullet hole in this dumpster. The size of the gash in the metal shows the sheer force of the gun that was used to kill the teen. Friends who didn't want to be identified say they loved him. The heartbreak clear in their voices. They say the teen was shot a few years ago and survived. And he got shot and we almost lost him then. Stockton police detectives released this picture of a silver SUV they believe is tied to this case. We feel like this um, vehicle is a piece of the puzzle that can help us solve or get some more information with regards to this homicide. Detectives are also looking for four men. Video surveillance uh, also revealed that the victim was on or, or near four uh, individuals that were near the, the SUV that we're trying to locate. Friends of the victim set up a small makeshift memorial, many expressing their feelings of sadness and loss. The community here is really scarred about it. We hurt right now, you know, but it's just, just random act of violence that don't make no sense, you know. It's just. Now, Stockton police say while violent crime is slightly up, crime overall in the city has decreased. And the worst year for homicides for violent crime in Stockton was 2012. The number then, 71. Back to you. Elizabeth Sarah, live in Stockton. Thank you for that report.